like I always do, I give a shout out to one of you guys who have commented on my previous video and the comment which I've chosen today is from TSA who says, Thank you so much for doing this video, it's amazing. Also the fight is on June 12th now. So yeah, he is correct in terms of the fight being changed from 5th of June to 12th of June. So thank you for that comment and if you want to see your comment to be uh, featured on my next video, all you guys have to do is go on to any of my videos and comment on that and I'll be picking another comment for my next video. Starting with this picture, I believe that we have majority pictures and we only have one footage of him actually training. So in this picture you can see some familiar faces, obviously on the left, far left is his actual boxing trainer, on the far right it's his sparring uh, partner and we are seeing a couple of new faces here. Right in the middle, uh, the three in the middle is new faces here, I believe there are actually a couple of sparring partners, new sparring partners for Deji. Now let's quickly move on to the next picture. Here is a massive difference you can see in this facial structure. Obviously like I said, the majority of, our, of these people here are familiar faces. I've been talking about them in my previous videos. But if you can see Deji here is uh, looking great actually. He's looking in great shape for the fight. Is less than a month and he is looking really good. So this is the only footage that we have available. Uh, you can see that Deji is just going ham on the bag. Yes, you can see that he's not punching that hard, but however, if you know boxing really well, you need to get these punches out there to keep the distance of your opponent. Uh, you need to have a lot of punches in the rounds as well. It's not all about power, it is also also about punches as well to get them points as well as getting that TKO will be crucial for Deji. Uh, his uh, punching ability will improve if he keeps doing these speed punches uh, training and that's what I believe that he's doing here. Now moving on to the third picture, this is not a lot you can take from this picture but however this picture was initially uh, taken from the story where his trainer actually said that they are going out for a meal after a training session. This is a fantastic relationship between the trainer and the trainee. Even the trainer is looking at his the trainee's nutrition, what is he taking and going after training with him to make sure that he's eating the correct food. We have seen Deji eating really bad in the previous uh, fight which he had against Jake Paul where KSI goes into his room and he's been eating wings and stuff but this is a fantastic relationship that they're having at the moment where Deji and his trainer is working even outside of the boxing ring on the nutrition side as well as improving other elements of his boxing skills. Now going into the last picture where we can see a couple of uh, similar photos but if you can see here the next picture where he is uh, posted next to his mother. From this picture you can see that he's lost a lot of weight. His jawline is popping. Around a month left to cut down that weight if he needs to. I don't believe he needs to because if he's going for that power it's good to keep on a bit of weight. So yeah this is the end of this video. If you like this video make sure you subscribe to the channel and show a lot of support by liking this video. Thank you very much for the 1500 subscribers on the channel. I am going to post frequently on the channel, I'm going to try post three times a week. Uh, I've been on a break for a week or so now but I'm trying to get back into YouTube, post three times a week. So yeah, until then, thank you very much and have a beautiful day.